the animals and really it's it's pretty similar to the like Midwest of the United States. It's not very tropical. I guess it could classify as tropical because because it's so humid. But there's no jungle there. There's no um, everything is grassland, uh, hills. There's no mountains. Um, there are several rivers, um, pretty large rivers. Um, there are they do have a couple of interesting animals like the. Uh, they have emus there, and ostriches, and they have this own their own kind of dog that's called a uh, um, what's that? A cimarron. It's this dog that has red and black coloring, or, or orange and black, and it's kind of spotted all over. It is some sort of savage or wild dog that would just roam out there, and sometimes they'll they'll domesticate it and use it for hunting maybe um, it's a pretty aggressive dog so it's always nasty if you met one of them in the streets and they they're also carpinchos which are I think they are the world's largest rodent this it's, it's like a giant hamster that comes maybe a foot and a half or two feet off the ground just standing up. It's very large. They, it's illegal to eat there. It's illegal to hunt it, but sometimes the, they they still do. And they say it, it's, the flavor is it's okay. It's a little gamey, but um, I had that. And they, other than that, they they have a lot of dogs there. Everyone has a dog, and that's, they they just love dogs, I guess, and so not too many cats. Um, plants, uh, yeah, plants, nothing too, um, too different than, uh, what you'd expect from just a normal uh, grassland area. Um, they do have quite a few trees. Um, everything grows there. Uh, any anything can grow there, I guess. They, um, but they don't they don't have any real crazy plants. They, I guess they do have. Um, I think it's aloe aloe vera aloe leaves. I don't know what the plant is. But they have. That's a pretty cool looking plant. It. It yeah, that was different. I'd never seen that before. <laughs>